Vice President Beelzebub, I mean Cheney, stated that we're in the midst of an energy crisis and that we have to build a power plant a week for 20 years before we're able to achieve enough electric power to meet our needs. But if we're really in an energy crisis, let's think about why we aren't using solar power. The only time we're really short of electricity is during the summer daytime peak. The rest of the time, there's too much electricity. We turn off generators to warm start conditions, an expensive process that is also wasteful. So in the summertime, during the daytime, a solar system would be the way to generate power. It comes on automatically in the daytime and it goes off at nighttime when we don't need the power. So if we're really in the midst of a crisis, why, we look around, do we not see any solar systems on these roofs? The market penetration for solar power is virtually zero. All these roofs, no solar power, and why should we build more plants that would be idle 22 hours out of the day? Moreover, electric power is not going to make you any more gasoline. Gasoline is a different power source. It comes from petroleum. Electricity can only be used for transportation if we have electric cars. The question is, why don't you have the possibility of buying an electric car like this? Out of 16 million cars built each year in the United States, there is not one plug-in car. 16 million cars built, hundreds of models, not one of them is a plug-in car. Yet, here is one that exists, that was built. They did exist, they do exist, they are possible. Why are we not building any? Why one solar system in this area is my neighbor who has a system on his roof that he put to, build, to power his electric car. Ford took his car away, sent it off to Norway, but he still has the solar system which now generates extra power in the daytime. But he doesn't have an electric car. The one system in, around here besides mine that, that, that is existing, that, does, that do, is part of the solution instead of being part of the problem. Now, the question is, why don't we have solar systems on our roof and electric cars in our garage? We don't have a car to plug in to use that electricity.